have on the planet. And as we zoom in here, we see a holotherian uh, with its uh, okay, video. It's two it feet good. reaching down into the sediment and pulling up sediment to its mouth parts uh, to consume that sediment. And you know, the holotherians move uh, sediment through their body to uh, derive nutrients from the small part bits of organic particles uh, that lie within the sediment. He's pretty happy there. Go tight to the feet. Okay. okay. What do we call those? I think you call them two feet. Cool. Just tilt up. Yep. So holotherians or, or sea cucumbers, um, you know, they typically don't move much. You can see them there moving there. Uh, but as a result, they are, have some really elaborate defense mechanisms. So um, they are able to eviscerate they, their guts, uh, for example, uh, and that will then stick to the predator and confuse them. They can also you know, swim over short distances to get away from things. Or, um, and uh, they also uh, have some secondary metabolites in their tissues that would uh, make them not as tasty to certain uh, species. That focus is uh, but there on are some on. sea cucumber uh, species that are uh, in shallow water, of course, that are I'm gonna say consumed that next time by humans. Uh, ROV and, uh, <laughs> some Asian cultures. There my are, hands are off. Uh, some species that are used in, in local cuisines. Uh, but yeah, sea cucumbers are a very diverse group uh, found in all of the world's oceans. Now over I'm on the stick. All depths okay. from really shallow to the really deep waters. Okay, let's tilt up and get the gut. And what we see the uh, the holotherian doing here again is, is consuming sediment and taking part in a process we call bioturbation. And that's a, a process by which organisms on the seafloor or in the seafloor uh, through behaviors like eating or, or burrowing uh, stir up the sediment and bring sediment from lower areas to the top and sediment from the top to lower areas uh, and in doing so uh, mix up the seafloor and so most of the seafloors we're seeing here have been worked over and, and moved uh, since their initial deposition uh, by organisms like this holotherian okay, happy with that uh, on the seafloor yeah, and other infaunal organisms that through. have stirred okay. up the sediment through their burrowing activity. Okay, and we use okay, uh, sort of a to lasers. concept of diff diffusion in the world of geology to understand uh, those processes by which the sediment gets the mixed no. and the, uh, the layering yeah. signal we use to, to think about okay. time uh, in the geology gets, right, gets skewed by this process of uh, bioturbation. I think he was in the, our good light pool. Yeah, and uh, since you're pointing that out, Adam, so things that uh, feed on 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 sediments and you know, other these. these